at Google I.O. 2023, Google showed off a new feature for Android 14 that lets you create custom wallpapers with a new feature called the Emoji Workshop. We can find this by long pressing on an empty spot of the home screen, then selecting the Wallpaper and Style option. Now you're going to want to scroll down a little bit and then select the More Wallpapers link down here. And you should see the Emoji Wallpaper card up here toward the top. This, this new feature that is being launched with Android 14 works by using some emojis to create unique wallpapers for you. So by default, it will automatically put some random emojis in this field for you. But we could go in here and remove these if we'd like. And then we can change them to some emojis that we actually want to see in our wallpaper. As of right now, we are allowed to have up to 14 different emojis in our custom wallpaper. And as mentioned, there are a lot to choose from. We can go through the categories as well to pick out the ones that we want to see on our home screen. We, we can swipe, swipe this card down so that we have a better view of our emoji workshop wallpaper. But we can then select one of the patterns from here. There, there are five to pick from right now but this could be changed in the future. There is a slider at the bottom that allows us to zoom in or zoom out of our custom wallpaper. And lastly, we can pick a color combination for our background and the outline of our emojis that we have picked. These combinations are predetermined, so sadly we can't pick a custom outline color with a background color of our choice. But there are some nice options to choose from here. Maybe we will see this updated in the future with the ability to pick a background color that we like and an outline color that we want. Now if you just wanted to see some automated combinations we can tap on the randomize button right here that will not only select random emoji for you to look at but also select a random pattern and a random color combination, as well as a random zoom in and zoom out setting. So if we end up finding one that we like, we can just apply it, or we can customize it a little bit so that it looks exactly how we want. Once applied, we can see the new emoji background as our wallpaper. And there's even a bit of animation that happens when we do things like scroll through our home screen panels. And there's another animation that happens whenever it gets plugged in. You can see it switch to the lightning bolt icons just for a second. And then they switch back to our emoji. The new emoji workshop for Android will even save your custom wallpapers so that you can switch between them or go on to create a brand new one. 
I'm reading that you can even use this feature on Android 13 devices, including Samsung Galaxy smartphones and tablets, as it just requires you to sideload the APK file before you can access this feature. If this is something that you would like to see a video on in the future, then let me know by using the comments section below. This is a fun little option that Google has added to Android 14, and I would be curious to see if other OEMs choose to include this in their stock firmware. I do wish that Google had spent more time developing different features for Android 14, as this does seem a bit unneeded. However, it is fun to play with, and I suspect a lot of people will end up getting some enjoyment out of it.